Before start this video, please subscribe my channel and click on bell icon. Thanks. Monroe Associates, a company specializing in reverse engineering and teardown benchmarking, recently disassembled the battery of a Lucid Air Grand Touring. Its engineers conducted a teardown to the cell level to understand how Lucid Air batteries are designed, and how the luxury sedan achieves its remarkable EPA-estimated driving range, between 384 to 516 miles, depending on the variant. Lucid Air's lower variants, Air Pure and Air Touring, get an 18-module battery pack while the Air Grand Touring gets a 22-module battery unit, according to Monroe Live, the company's YouTube channel where the results were posted. The absence of the four additional modules in the Air Touring, mounted under the rear floor, helps free footwell space for the rear occupants. The lower trims get a 92 kilowatt hour battery, while the Grand Touring gets a 112 kilowatt hour unit, as per the Monroe engineers. It's the latter that they disassembled to study its internals. Buckle up, because the following information might sound like a science class, and is revelatory of how technologically advanced the Lucid Air battery is. The modules are mounted on an epoxy glass fiber composite floor, a material that reportedly provides great thermal insulation and corrosion resistance. For structural purposes, the floor has machined aluminum castings at the front, rear, and sides. Another aluminum casting divides the battery at the center into two sections. Each module is divided into 10 parts, with 30 cylindrical cells for each part, totaling 300 cells per module. By this calculation, a single Lucid Air Grand Touring battery would have 6, 600 cells. What makes this battery unique are the three sheet molding compound, SMC, lids, another compressed high strength material that contributes to holding the pack together, as per the engineers. These materials are held together by structural adhesives, a huge proportion of which made it difficult for the engineers to tear down this lucid air battery. The battery management system, BMS, its brains in simple terms, is integrated into a printed circuit board assembly, PCBA, which as per the engineers was the largest they had seen. The Lucid Air's battery had not one but two such brains, two BMS circuit boards with an unusually large footprint. A Tesla PCBA in comparison was much smaller the engineer said. One drawback of the Lucid Air battery is the size of one of the bus bars, a solid metal bar that carries current between modules. Due to the aluminum casting in the center that separates the battery into two parts, Lucid had to use a larger central bus bar, which can drive up costs and use a lot of space. Smaller U-shaped bus bars are more practical, said the engineers. Another pitfall of this battery is that certain parts are more difficult to disassemble compared to Tesla or Rivian batteries, which are relatively easier to tear down, and hence possibly easier to service as well. Overall though, the engineers felt like Lucid's philosophy was to make everything as condensed and tightly packed as possible. Thanks for watching. Credits to Incidives.com Please like my video and subscribe EVpedia for more electronic vehicle news and updates.